Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Welcome to the video session of Cantor Publisher. So you should have in your hands the textbook of Cambridge Scholar series of English 3. So here is a plan of study for you. We have divided our chapter number first into four lectures. The first lecture is of the grammar portion and we have to study the use of articles that are a and the the three articles we will be discussing our lesson name is the holy prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam in our first lecture here is the grammar portion so the articles are a and the in the previous classes we have studied the use of a and also the use of n. Here it is. A is used before consonant sounds and n is used before vowel sounds. Yes. So what are the vowel letters that are a, e, i, o, u. So any word that sounds like these letters in the start will be in this category and before that and will be used and the rest of all shall be moved towards this category of the consonant sounds in which a will be used before that word so now we are going for examples here you have to use in and tell the reason the first example is i have an orange why n is used shabash tell me yes n is used because the word is starting from what o o is what o is a vowel but we have to listen towards the sound of the vowel and orange is giving a vowel sound yes because orange and o is what a vowel so that is why n is used the next one is qaidi azam was an honest man yes honest man here the sound of h is silent and it terms like honest so honest sounds like what a vowel sound because h is silent and o is giving the sound so that is why n is used before the honest so kaidi azam was an honest man and not a will be used here the next example is he is an m a he is an m a m a means master of arts so here m a m is giving the sound of vowel that is why n is used the next one is he is in a university he is in a university why a is used here shabash give me the answer hmm because u is not giving the vowel sound how because university that is u ni were c t it sounds like university so this is not a vowel sound that is why although u is a vowel letter u is a vowel letter but it does not sound like a vowel sound so we are emphasizing here the sound that is why a is used here the next example is you have an umbrella 
and U has a vowel sound here in Amarilla. That is why N is used. She is reading an interesting book. Yes, N is used because I is a vowel sound. I is a vowel sound. Yes. The next example is, this is a utensil. Why N is not used? Q N used nahi hua? Yes, because U again, U, the same that has been used in university, again U is not giving the vowel sound. The sound is not a vowel sound. That is why N is not used and A is used. The next one is, he is an umpire. He is an umpire. Here again, N is used. And because of, because of, U is giving a vowel sound. So, now, you have already studied previously the use of A and N and we have revised your memory. Now we are going to discuss the use of what? The use of the. The is used in many cases. The first case is when you have to denote a group, the is used. For example, the horses run fast. Here is a group of horses. That is why the is used here. And secondly, the is used before third degree of adjective. Now, what is an adjective? So, what is adjective? Adjective are basically words that tells more about a noun. For example, a tall doctor, a beautiful house, a sweet dog. Here, tall is what? An adjective. Beautiful is what? An adjective. Sweet is what? An adjective. Because it tells us more about the noun. The noun is doctor, the noun is house, the doll is house. It is telling us that the doctor is tall. So it gives us more information about a noun. So that is why tall, beautiful and sweet are termed as adjective. Now, big bigger biggest you are seeing the picture of three elephants this one is a big elephant relative to a person this one is even bigger and this one is the biggest these are the three basic degrees of adjective because big elephant so big is what an adjective and elephant is what a noun it gives us an information about the noun but this is called the first degree of adjective what first degree adjective bigger is the second degree adjective and biggest is third degree adjective so here in the example you are seeing that one is the biggest elephant now biggest is the third degree adjective that is why the is used before that the second example is this is the tallest tree here you are seeing that this tree is the tallest. The tall is the first degree of adjective. Taller is the second and tallest is third degree adjective. So, 
that is why the is used before the third degree adjective now you have to fill in the blanks that is on page number seven and eight of the textbook that is with a and the the first blank is Peshawar is dash big city now tell me what would be the right answer a and or the yes a is the right answer because big is a consonant sound and no formulations are there for using the the next one is dash dog is a faithful animal hmm the dog is a faithful animal because dog is a proper noun shahir is dash honest boy hmm honest is what honest is a vowel sound so here and will be used arshina is dashed eldest daughter in his house so eldest is what eldest is the third degree adjective so the will be used dash cat drinks milk hmm. a cat drinks milk because cat is a consonant sound you are dash good teacher you are a good teacher because good is a consonant sound these are dash easiest sums the is used because easiest are third degree adjectives here you have the homework students you have to read your first lesson and you have to mark what you have to mark a and the these three articles you have to mark from your chapter the next homework is from your workbook here there are multiple choice questions and you have to select the right answer the next is the homework from summer pack and you have to select again the right answer we have already discussed in our chapter in a detail again these are the homeworks for you people that has been present on the page 5 of summer pack now here is an activity so you have to get the list of the words that start with a and 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 the and write under each heading here the words that are going to start from a for example a cat for example and what yes an umbrella the what yes the biggest so in this order you have to fill all the blanks so thank you students good luck for the today's lecture and allah hafiz